Virgo. Hello, it's your girl from Amethyst Rose Tarot. Coming through to give you a 72 for you. All right, this will be for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. Please take what resonates and leave the rest for go. 72 for you is yesterday, today, tomorrow. We're going to tie up the energy for you, see what messages are the most important for you to know um, and know what's coming, okay? All right, so this is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. Archangel Michael, please protect me as I channel the energy for Virgo. Please block any interference that stop the message from coming through. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors, and Spirit Gods, what messages do you have for Virgo at this time? What should Virgo know? Send me two for you. Virgo. Remember me by Jeremiah. Okay. Knight of Swords. Somebody could be rushing in. Could be an Aquarius. An Aquarius could be rushing towards you. Speeding. You got the Three of Pentacles here. Yeah, somebody may want to cooperate now or voice this to you, say this to you, how they want to invest. Yeah, this person is definitely coming in. Whoever this person is. They're coming fast, too. Definitely arriving in the next 72 hours. <laughs> They're already on their way. Thank you. King of Wands. All right. So some can have something to do with a fire sign masculine. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Tell me more. Wow. Come on now, Virgo. All right. Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so that's you. Page of Cups. Four of Pentacles. Ace of Swords. With the Lovers. It's giving me that somebody is just going to express to you clearly how they feel about you. Or this connection. Yeah, it looks like it's a, it, you could be dealing with the Gemini here. But it looks like somebody is going to communicate how they feel. It looks like it's it's going to be a reconciliation here. Yeah, back and forth communication here with whoever this person is. And this person doesn't want to waste any time. They're gonna, they, they've been holding back from you, but now they want to express whatever this is. They want to give you clarity. You got the strength card here. Yeah, after they peel back from you. This could have been somebody who resisted you, put you in a third party situation, yeah. Um, had you competing or put you in competition, six of swords. This person could live at a distance from you or the distance that you live could be significant. But it's looking like whatever this is, whatever this communication is or this clarity that comes in, it's going to make things easier for forward movement or smooth selling. It's like things are going to go smooth after you get whatever this, this clarity is. Because this is a divinely guided connection here. These It looks like it's two people you're, you're meant to be with this fire sign. Could be a Leo. Yeah. Somebody could have Gemini and Leo. How they aspect it in their chart. Yeah, but it looks like you're meant to be with whoever this person is. Mm-hmm. All right, let's get a few clarifiers. This looks like it's gonna be a short one. Girl of my dreams by Ride Wave. Off the album Pray for Love. So somebody gonna pray for whatever this is, this person to rush back in and reconcile with you. And that's what they're doing. It's looking like they're apologizing. They're not being so forceful with you or so boastful or whatever the case. They're being a little bit more sensitive with you. That's what this is giving me. Still giving me very much fire. Somebody is still very masculine, whoever this is. Whether it's a feminine or a masculine. But it's looking like it's, it's going to be a reconciliation here. Yeah. When things get cleared up. The lovers. Why is the lovers here for Virgo? Someone rising in the North Node. 
Yeah, somebody is the girl of somebody's dreams. They pray for this. The lovers. Or the man of somebody's dreams. I mean, take it how it resonates. <laughs> the lovers. Judgment. Yes. Okay, so listen. Somebody could be, this Gemini could be making their mind up. Or you could be making your mind up about this Gemini. To, to you know, end whatever this is. Or something. It just ended badly with, it, with this Gemini. But look what we got right behind it. The lovers again. So something could have been like a false connection here. Like counterfeit before the real thing. Hmm. I'm getting something like repeated itself. Or this could be this person want to repeat. But judgment is a card of reconciliation. So it looks like it's going to be a a reconciliation with the Gemini after this harsh ending, whatever it was, and it's gonna move smooth after that. Is what it's giving me. All right, what's your strength card for Virgo? Yeah, something is just gonna be smooth sailing. Strength card. This is for Virgo. The Sun. This Leo, I told you, they, I said they still going to be a Leo now. They still giving me very much Leo energy. Yeah, but somebody could have Sagittarius highly aspected, yeah, highly aspected as well. But I'm getting that somebody is seeing somebody like as an angel, like whoever this person is that's rushing in. This could be a Sagittarius or somebody who has a highly aspected as well. But whatever this is, is going to make you very happy, Virgo. You're happy to have this person back. They hurry on and they done, they, they done, they done made up their mind. Or they hurry in and make their mind up. Yeah. Somebody can have Aries highly aspected. But yeah, they're gonna somebody's gonna give somebody some some clarity. Ace of Swords, whatever this is, whatever they're saying is true. Yeah, so if they're so if they're telling you they want to work on this, it's true. Yeah, Ace of uh, Knight of Wands. Yeah, whatever this is, somebody has transformed here. Somebody could have been a player. Yeah, but whatever they tell you is true. They mean what they say here. Yeah. So let's get a divine abundance card. Congratulations, Virgo. Yeah, because it's looking like whatever this is, is meant to be. With the lovers out here, judgment, six of swords, stream card, the sun. Yeah, with the ace of swords. Yeah, whatever this is, it's, it's, it's a lot of reconciliation energy here and a lot of clarity. It's like the two of you are going to, you know, just move on past whatever this is and work on things but this person they're coming they're speeding they're going very fast okay you know this person is sex with me right by rihanna okay i mean they might be coming in a little frisky i mean i don't know look like it's gonna be good though with the sun card and somebody could have been holding back right here. They haven't had sex in a while with the four pentacles in the stream card. Yeah. That's probably why they had such a big rush. <laughs> oh, the vine of this oracle for Virgo. Somebody wants ya. Yes. They said they want to work on things. Somebody, the girl or the man or somebody dreams. Sign. Instincts are the message from the inner divine. Yeah, you could have been seeing um, signs and synchronicities um, around you. Maybe you've been um, seeing the number three a lot or 33. Yeah, you may have been seeing the number eight or something like that. So, yeah, it, it, it's, it, it's possible. All right, karma. There is nothing from a past life that can't be addressed in the current life. So it just looks like somebody is just, they paid their karmic debt. And now they get to be happy. 
Yeah. Somebody's paid their dues here. Somebody's they they work to pay their dues. Ace of Swords with the Eight of Eight of Pentacles. Yeah. Mm hmm All right. Well, that is your message, Virgo. Please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye.